My biggest fear is really just losing him. We have very young children, and he is everything to us. He's our whole world. It is not just the officer in uniform on the streets worried about being targeted these days. It is up the ante for their families already worried every time they kiss their officer goodbye for work. You throw it? Throw it? Woo! Ashley Jones is trying hard to keep a smile on her face for her kiddos, even though her heart is breaking. She's like, Mom, are you okay today? Her three little ones, too little to understand how the news in the last 24 hours <laughs> has changed their world. Their daddy's been a Tempe police officer nine years now. You just want to cry. You really do, because that could be your husband. That could be mine. Innocent officers murdered and under attack in a growing anti-cop movement. There are bad cops out there. Right. Just, just but, like there's bad doctors, there's bad nurses, there's, there's bad seeds in every, every um, occupation. Jones says police are under more scrutiny than ever before, and social media's unleashed so much divisive hate, she's had to unfriend people on Facebook. Other people just see the badge. They just see an officer, they don't see a person. But there is an upside. She's a member of Partners in Crime, a Facebook group for law enforcement spouses. Is a sisterhood. They bake treats for patrol, fundraise for families, a support base at the ready 24-7. We can vent and we can, we can cry with each other. We can even rejoice in some of the happy times. Jones is also a photographer working with others on a project called Love Behind the Badge to help humanize police officers. I really want people to understand and know that they are fathers and they are mothers and they come home to families every day. And you know, the other takeaway here is these law enforcement families say they're very proud of their officer because it is a calling. It's not just a job, but now there's this kind of shift, Brandon, of mm -hmm. a real fear of showing that pride. Even lighting a blue light on the porch, there was right. that whole movement, or maybe having one of those thin blue line decals on your car that maybe you might be targeted for showing support to law enforcement, that there's been such a shift. I don't know, Nicole, if, if many of our viewers at home know this.